god. <gasps> oh! oh my god. They're here. Jesus, Louise, can I hide? Can I hide? Ah! Welcome to a new game called They Are Here Alien Abduction Horror. This is Campbell Commando. Welcome, guys. So, this is a demo version. This new game is coming out 2022. And it is a first person horror story about a journalist who witnessed an alien abduction at the Grayswood Farm. So, we only have just <laughs> a flashlight. And we gotta take photos of evidence of aliens' presence and try to find out the horrifying truth of what's going on on this farm. Well, I love me some alien stories. Guys, do you believe in aliens? Comment below if you believe in aliens. I used to love this kind of genre back when I was a kid. I used to watch all those alien movies, alien cartoons. Oh man, I would eat them all up. And now that I get to play it, oh, it's gonna be fun. So let's find out together, guys. I've never played it. Oh, okay. Unexplained phenomena occurred at Grayswood Farm on the night of August 7th. The Sherman family witnessed bright lights in the sky that moved at breakneck speed over the cornfield. The lights moved in a random direction and at different speeds. After a while, they vanish. This strange behavior in the sky was observed at the same time each night for five nights. According to the owner of the farm, all the animals went crazy. The dog became aggressive, tried to attack him, and bit him. The children complained that someone was walking under their windows. Farmer Peter Sherman himself in the field saw a strange figure that did not look like a man. What is it? Deliberate deception? Drawing attention to oneself? Or a sensation about an alien invasion? Journalist Taylor Fox traveled to Gray's Wood Farm to take a photo and make report for the local newspaper. Oh. Let's see here, boys. Oh, right here. Taz, talk to Farmer Peter Sherman. Wow, look at the night skies. Oh, are those those aliens? Oh, they're moving. Yep, it's true. Look at that. All right, okay, we can move. So this is our local news station van. <laughs> and why are we alone at nighttime? Shouldn't we have like a crew with us? I'm guessing the car broke down, right? Because that's always the story, is that whenever there's a UFO... Oh, let's take a picture. This is great material for a news report. Oh, hell yeah. All right, let's go. Yeah, there, whenever there's an alien sighting, a car or a vehicle would always break down. I wouldn't go to that area, but first... But first... Oh no, we can't go further, huh? Okay. Oh... Why does it always have to be nighttime whenever there's a horror game? Why can't it be in like the daytime, you know? More lighting, more people. Okay. Okay, what was that? Did you guys hear that? Well, I heard the corn fields crackling. It was crackling. <laughs> I hope that was just a rat, an animal. Oh God. The door, the door is ajar. Okay, that lamp is so loud. Okay. What does it say here? Farmer's note. Mr. Fox, we made an appointment but something bad happened. Our daughter went missing. My wife went to town for help. My son and I went to check on the farm. 
We'll leave notes for you and the police in case we pass each other. Be careful. Peter Sherman. All right. Okay, there's nothing here in the back. Got it, got it. Let's put it back. All right, let's check out. Why do you leave your door open, bro? A thief? Oh, it's not working. It's not working. Okay, okay. Why do you leave the phone like this? Why can't you just put it back where it belongs? <laughs> uh, why? That seems like it's a wait. Let's open this door, maybe? Oh, it's locked. All right, let's see here. Let's check out the newspaper. They are here. Mystery sky object seen here. Oh, so that's the farmer and his dog. His buddy boy. Oh, what's this? What's it say right here? Extraterrestrial hypothesis still unproved. Oh, those are the cornfields. Okay, how come, you know, in the very, in the heights of the alien invasion uh stories there's always a cornfield and the alien seems to like make signs when they're here and why is it always in like the middle of nowhere why not in like the big cities so this is his little baby boy oh what's this <gasps> that's his daughter child drawing it looks like this drawing was made by the missing daughter of the farmer the leaf is painted on both sides what this is when it's happy and this is when it's <gasps> the alien killed a doggo oh oh that's it you know what that's 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 the last straw whenever they kill a dog i'm angry farmer's note it is my daughter's room. During the night, I heard a strange noise. When I came in, she wasn't in her bed, and the window was wide open. I'm sure she was abducted by those things. Oh, no. Oh, no. No. Can I put this up? Apparently, it belongs to the missing girl. If you listen closely, you can hear a very strange noise. Property of Nigan, Negan. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm hearing strange noises in that. <gasps> See that window? Okay. Can I do another light? Spooky, spooky. Okay, I can crouch. Okay, let's get out of here. Okay, there's a bright light right here. I don't want to go there. I don't want to go there yet. Let's just check out something else. Okay, I guess we got to go in here. All right, here goes nothing. Oh, it's just a TV. Oh, look at that. <gasps> Photo from the internet, perhaps me Perhaps Peter Sherman saw some similar. It looks creepy. Ugh. Oh, this is the autopsy. Ugh, look at the eyes on that. Jeez Louise. Oh, that alien's been creeping. That alien is so sus. He's been watching the farmer. Okay. Farmer's known. I've learned a lot about these things. They are called the greys. These are not little green men, but big, creepy, and dangerous creatures. Basically, they can be described in the following way. A large head, disproportionate to the body, no hair, bottomless black ass, gray skin, long thin limbs, and sharp claws. Their voices are like nothing else. These aliens are very aggressive towards people. It all starts with bright lights in the sky near homes which move along a certain way. Then people start to have a nosebleed, have severe headaches, 
and a buzz in their ears, and animal starts raging. Next, people start to have memory lapses, periods which they don't remember anything. When they come back to normal, they find themselves in unexpected places. For example, in the middle of a field or on a road a few kilometers away from home. Some of them have a flashback of terrible memories. People remember terrifying experiences. The aliens established control over their minds and this has affected their psyche. Also, they found the marks on the body, incisions to be exact, during palpations. It felt like some thick, like a foreign object moving under their skin. Ooh. I guess the farmer's been taking notes, huh? Okay. Okay, anything else? Anything? Oh, what is this? Farmer's Child Diary. Sticker. Found my old diary from when I was 15 years old. How could I forget that? Oh. Look at the drawing. My god, he's a talented little boy there. Alright, let I'll let you guys read it. Oh god. <gasps> oh! oh my god! They're here! Jesus Louise, can I hide? Can I hide? <laughs> Press F for the flashlight. Oh dear lord. They're here. My god, they're here. I don't think... I don't think I'm safe, guys. Oh, oh god. Oh. Oh. oh my god. Jesus Christ. God. Okay. Okay. Alright, let's go down. Let's go down. We're not alone. We are not alone, boys. <gasps> it's tipped over. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. I made a mistake playing this game. It's so scary. It's so scary. Ah, this door was closed before. Now it's open. Turn off this. Let's turn on this. strange, unpleasant, tingling sensation in the back of my head have started as well. Now, I understand why the doctors could not determine the cause of the migraines. The answer is simple. Abduction! I only remember the alien abduction when I was found by my diary. It was then that the migraine began. The cuts that I noticed then behind the ear were a trace of them. 
I'm sure they implanted something in me, some kind of transmitter or implant because of this. I forgot everything. I definitely decided that I would get it. I'm not crazy. Okay, okay. Before this crap happened, oh my god, he took it out? So well, first of all, before this whole thing just happened, I thought you were crazy already, but now, I don't think so, or maybe I'm crazy. Jeez Louise, that's it right here, look at this. A little jar with a strange device. In the note, Peter Sherman claimed that he cut out an alien a plant from behind his ear. Oh, let's take that picture. There we go. Okay, all right. What do we do now? I hope we're not gonna be a... Oh God. Is that you? Oh God. Let's just crouch. Stay quiet. Can I open this door? Hello? Mr. Alien, please don't abduct me. Don't cut me up. I didn't plan anything for me, okay? I'm just a journal. Oh my god, are they here? Oh, it's moving. Oh! That's my car. Let's go back. Let's go check it out. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ah! Oh my god! Pass, run to the car! Let's run to the car! Oh my god! I don't know where to turn around! Are they here? Oh, oh. I'm having goosebumps. Oh my god! Oh my god! What? What do we do? Can I drive? Please work! Please work! Jesus Christ! Oh, that's the ship! That's the mother ship! I think I'll be abducted! Oh dear lord! Christ. That was, that was, that was scary. Oh God, guys. Oh my God, guys. Guys, if you want me to play this game, let me know in the comments. And when this game comes out, I guess I'll play it. I'm, 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 I'm dizzy. I'm dizzy. Oh my God. Jesus Christ. All right, guys. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. All right, guys. If you wanted me to play this game, I hope you don't. This game is scary. I hope you can go. I, uh, I can't even talk. I hope you can. I hope you enjoy this gameplay. Hopefully, you guys enjoy that laugh. Enjoy the game as well. If you want more of this, put it down in the comments. Give me that thumbs up. And I'll see you guys next time.